Hello, welcome to my channel. Brian Swell here. Today I'm gonna paint this commission that I got yesterday uh, from uh, Maggie Brooks. She's a sculptor from USA. Thank you, Maggie. Okay. Hello, Eve. Hello, Iman, Naimi, Dennis. Hello, Joyce, Michael, Ardesh. Okay, let's start. Let's start for the drawing. I'm gonna mix a little bit of white and blue. A little bit of medium. Okay. First, I gotta think this is gonna be the space for mixing the paints. And now I have all this space and so squinting my eyes and just trying to separate this image. Uh, first, I see this diagonal here, which is going to help me um, here. I have all this space and I have here. Okay. Here. The head. It's going to be around here, the guitar. And the body here. Okay. Always looking for simple shapes, lines. Let's say from her shoulder to the guitar, you trace a line like this. Make this. Can you hear me? Oh my God, I just forgot to maybe have <laughs> promise again. Hello, hello. Hello, Maggie. <laughs> There's Maggie. Yes. Okay. And the shoulder. I gotta move the image a little bit. You know, I have a bigger image to my left. And I have this image here. I have another image here. And I have the image in my computer. I'm going to be in the shoulder, arm, okay, I'm going to keep this one here, just for you to see how I draw, how I draw. okay, the guitar around here, the hand is going to be around here, Okay, this is my limit here. I mean, obviously, I, I'm not, I don't have, I'm gonna paint the hand, but you're gonna see me, you're not gonna see me painting the hand because it's just, uh, I mean, that was so difficult to, this is kind of big for, for YouTube, because I gotta put the camera just a little far away, and that makes me be a little far away from the painting. Like the head, the head here, the face here. I just squinting my eyes, trying to see simple shape like this, this, this. Okay, the neck. The other hand is around, it's a line with the neck around here. Okay. The face, the hand, the other hand. Okay, you see this? Okay, okay. Here. Okay. I'm gonna add more white, more medium. Uh, right now, I'm just watching a space, a negative space, this here. Okay. 
Another negative space for me that would be the hair. I mean, the hair is not, not a negative space, but I'm just thinking this way because I'm just thinking that it's not the, the principal shape. Okay. I have a shape. I have the neck. I have this. I'll continue here. You know, right now, I don't like this. Uh, for me, it's too much light. I don't see her hand. I mean, I'm going to keep maybe this dark. But that's going to be for later. Now I'm just drawing. OK. Hmm. In my eyes, okay. another brush now. Mix an orange, a little bit of black, white, more red. Okay, so maybe for the face. Face, one hand here, one hand here. I don't know if you can follow me. I'm trying just to uh, put uh, the, uh, the figure here, but just, I mean, first, my first ap approach was just trying to capture the figure, okay? Now, I'm moving things just by trying to capture the negative space, like this, this. And now I'm just trying to follow like uh, shapes, like shapes, the face, hand, and hand here. Okay, another neg negative space here, space here, and here, and here. Okay, that I'm, I'm drawing right now. I'm doing this because I'm just, that's my way to put things together. Now, I'm gonna mix. I was thinking to make her uh, jacket red. A little bit of medium. Still, this is too light. Okay, here. And now I squint my eyes and what I'm, gonna, what I'm going to do is just make all this shape here this hair and the hair, okay? Squint in my eyes. Mm -hmm. It's okay. I don't like the color. I'm gonna mute this color a little bit more. shape here now this portion here okay Oh, Denise, why not Jimmy Hendrix? Oh, this is a commission, Denise. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's continue. Now I'm going to see just the face 
And I'm gonna draw the center line of the face, gonna be around here, the line for the eyes. One eye here, another eye here, nose, mouth. Just drawing right now. You know, I'm tracing, uh, I'm trying to look for alignments, like from the chin to the hand, from here, uh, the, the wrist up to here. See? Here, up here. Oh, from here, I don't know what's the name of this, but this say the handle of the guitar, the guitar handle to the hair. Okay, I'm trying to see from here to here. Try to see this negative space. Okay. Now let's add more paint. Let's put the image here again. I just need, need an eraser to keep the image, to stick the image here. Okay. Now, thinking about color. I mean, definitely, I'm not gonna keep this light, it's too much. I'm gonna make this darker because I wanna see her hand, okay? That's gonna be a nice touch. Okay, I wanna, I wanna make this red. I mean, it's not gonna be pure red. Maybe the only part that's gonna be pure red is gonna be this light, this reflected light here, okay? And this is gonna be that, like a dark red. Mm-hmm. I mean, and this is a uh, good guitar. I mean, it's gonna be like brownish, reddish color. Okay, let's work a little bit on the face. change to the synthetic brushes. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to squint in my eyes. I think the eyes should be up. Like around here. The other one here. Eyebrow. Eyebrow, nose, mouth. Okay, squinting my eyes again. Mm, okay. I'm stepping back and trying to, I'm gonna see here the eye and the eyebrow because I can use this, see the shape. I mean, I gotta find something where I can, from, from where I can still building up the face. If I don't find anything, I, I mean, I got, I gotta find always something. In this case, I was just watching. I just see this, which that's gonna help me. You see how clear it is. There is. Okay. 
Okay. Now I can see this side of the face. Here. Hello, Luz, Lynn. Hello, Rocio. Dennis asking me uh, if, ah, asking to, asking if. Okay, sorry. Mm -hmm. Okay, hello, Irma. Hello, Monique. Hello, Terry. Eric. Lisa. Okay. Okay. Let's continue. Christine, Colin, and Divan. Okay. Hello, everyone. Mm, just stepping back. Okay. Another thing that I just have seen right now in a minute. We are follow the obviously the overall shape of the face. Face. And every time I, I, I watch the face, okay, and I watch the relationship from the face to the guitar, always checking because, I mean, when we have an image like this, the problem uh, that would be maybe uh, at the end, the head is going to be maybe bigger or smaller in relationship to the guitar and the, the, the arms, the hands. And that would be a problem, okay? And obviously, I mean, when it's a commission, the likeness is the, the most important thing. I mean, a client is not going to be happy if the likeness is not there. Okay, it's not, for a client, it's not going to be about the color, harmony, or no, nothing. There's going to be nothing about that. Okay. But we gotta pay attention to everything, yes. Add green to the hands because I'm planning to add, uh, add a lot of red. Sorry, guys, you're not going to see me painting this hand here. Here is a dark blonde, it has a bit of yellow there, highlight. Here, and if I add red to her jacket, that's, that red is going to be just in the highlight, just here. Gonna be the only red here. It's gonna be dark. Okay. 
Okay, so an accent here in the jacket, I can put this maybe black. Mm. Oh no, it could be an accent that. Yes, because I think that's, I don't know what it is, but I mean, that, I think that's this, some kind of holder for the guitar, yes? Okay, let's see. If I put this. I mean, I'm thinking right now about the that's going to work as an accent for the painting, yes? A dark accent. Because I'm not planning to go dark with the hair. I mean, she has a, she's blonde, she has a dark blonde hair. That means I'm not gonna go, I can, I can go too dark here. That's, that's gonna be enough, I think. more interesting this thing about the commission may, maybe I can say that okay uh, I'm taking commissions and if you don't like you don't pay it wow no that would be too much risk yeah yeah I want the money <laughs> too much risk yeah but I'm pretty sure I mean if, if Maggie doesn't like this painting yeah, that would be a problem but anyway I mean if this painting doesn't come out okay, I mean, I'm gonna work on, on this painting, obviously more more hours until get this one perfect. Okay, I have red here. Obviously this is an accent. They say this blonde, uh, you can see how this highlight here in the background I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna see the hand. The only way to see the hand is just create contrast. And I can just make maybe an accent here, just a little bit of highlight. And here it should be darker. Here, this kind of bluish, dark color. And I'm gonna keep just this kind of bluish, light bluish color. Okay, let's add more black to the background. You see, okay, here's gonna be my limit. I think that's okay. Do you, do you see the difference? I mean, from, I don't know, maybe I'm wrong because you saw this photograph and uh, I'm pretty sure it was taken in a studio. They were very careful with the lighting, with all, the, all of those details. But for me, it's like this light here is just too much. Keep my, keep my attention too much from the face. I mean, I just need to, See the face, a little bit of light here. I need to see the hand, okay? And the other hand, this other hand. And these accents, that's gonna work okay. Okay, I'm gonna read the comments. Uh, hi, Crisalida, hello Crisalida, hello Michael. Hello Fati, 
Claudita. A commission means a command. No, a commission is an, an, an order. Yes. He looks like hair already, right? So I like the red. Okay, that's good, Maggie. Yeah. Yes. Okay. She has brown brown eyes. Okay, brown eyes. Okay. I continue. And here it's gonna be just dark. To, I mean, to enhance this too. And uh, obviously, I need to work here because I don't want this just light. I'm gonna keep maybe a little bit of pure red here. I'm gonna kill this a little bit. Kill this a little bit. Yes, in this way, you don't, you don't see like blue, something like this. Yeah. And somebody told me something about the leg. Maybe said, yes, that's the leg here. And then I can make a little bit of a leg. Okay. Now I just want to see some color of on the hand. Usually, I mean the knuckles. I put the image again. Oh, I got a mistake here. It's like this. Okay. You want to see the hands really kind of pinky, reddish? You have to add first green. Don't get rid of the green. Okay? You gotta see the green from the beginning to the end. And some red, reddish accents on the, on the hands. I mean, that's my advice. That works for me. But it's about controlling. I mean, the, the red and, and, and the in the pinky color. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's work on the face. I mean, the width right now is not good. I'll reduce here the face. I, I'm just working all around because I don't want to get caught up on the face. Uh, I mean, when we start working on the face, we usually spend a lot of time. But one problem, like I said, I mean, the face, maybe I will make the face okay. But if I make the face bigger or smaller, that's going to change all of this. I don't want that.
I'm gonna read the comments a little bit. Okay. Okay. Oh, 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 Denise, we don't see the same picture. What I see is a girl with a guitar between the legs. Okay. Okay. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, okay. Mm, you, you, made me, you, you, you just made me think about the image. Okay. Monique, what is the closest green if you don't have chrome green? Or are you just gonna, gonna mix uh, cerulean blue and uh, lemon yellow? The, I don't have lemon yellow here. But I don't have I don't have it because I don't need I don't need it. Because I have this chrome green. Continue working on it. Uh, okay, let me see. Let me see. Let, let me step back. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Sorry, I'm just thinking, thinking about the color harmony, thinking is everything is gonna work okay, thinking about proportions, trying to see mistakes here and there. Okay. If it's a commission, it's money involved. Yeah. We gotta be careful. Stepping back again. <laughs> I need music. Okay. I wish you could speak, guys. This way, that would be different, more, more enjoyable, more relaxing. Yeah. Let me see if I keep a little bit light here. Mm. 
Not much. Okay. Let's work on let's work on the face. I was just thinking, thinking for a moment, trying to see, try to 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 see the proportion, mostly the proportions, okay? Like uh just trying to um like measure, I mean visual measurements and taking visual measure measurements everywhere. I'm trying really hard to keep things together uh, in the relationship between face, hands, guitar, and the body. Okay, I think that's okay. okay. If you see any mistake, please don't tell, <laughs> don't tell Maggie, Maggie Brooks. <laughs> don't tell her. At the end, you gotta say, oh my God, this is just amazing. In this way, I, I get paid. No, I already got paid, but. <laughs> okay, let's, let's make details. Holding my hand with my other hand. A bit more red for the nose. Stepping back. Okay, I'm going to read the comments. Maggie. Much of the time, I can't, I cannot hear you because the sound is poor. So you ask questions I, and I don't answer that. It's like, okay, Maggie. Well, Brandy is asking, is the canvas being used as the palette? Yes, it is. St. Lou is asking, do you imagine every color? Okay, uh, not every color. I mean, Maggie told me that she has dark blonde hair and the guitar is a good guitar and oh, I mean she's white obviously and I just imagined the color I was thinking okay if the background like a bluish grayish back background and some red here is gonna work I mean obviously I was not thinking about red I was thinking about this accent a red accent it is gonna be darker okay I was thinking about that I know I was thinking this right all over here, that, that would be too much. And I was thinking about blue, but blue is kind of, it was, I mean, mm, you could make it kind of work every color, but it's gonna take you more from some colors because 
Every time they choose a color, you, you have to think in harmony. Harmony, that means that the color has to be around, like, it, like maybe sometimes not noticeable, so subtle, but it should be around. I mean, right, obviously, it's in the skin, it's in the hair, it's in the guitar because it's good. It's kind of obvious, eh? Blue here, let's say, or purple here. That would mean spread the purple here or, or in the background to make it work. I mean, harmony just means that we need to, let's say, create some rhythm, repetition of the color here and there. Okay. Oh, where I was? Okay, I was working, think on the face. Okay, somebody's asking me, uh, wondering about permanent green or wings or green. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Okay. Denise, could you make the camera higher? Okay. I'm pretty sure I have so many options with the camera. I don't know how to use them. I never tried it. Okay. Uh, well, I will try to, to investigate more about that. I will try. I mean, I don't want to. Okay, I, I will try because of I mean. Okay, I mean, that takes a little time. Just set up the camera and all of those things. You know what? I want to paint. <laughs> I don't want to spend a lot of time just with all those things. That's why one of the reasons that you, you see me here making live streams because I'm just, wow. It takes a lot of time to edit, edit a video, put voice over. It's too much work. It's too much work. It can take days, maybe for a professional in that area, video edition and all of that. Pretty sure it's gonna take for somebody like uh, that knows about that, maybe just a few hours, but for me, it's just it's days trying to edit a video. Hello, somebody. <laughs> Terry, turns to you think her face seems longer and narrower? Yeah, maybe. It's too early to say, to, to tell that. I mean, it, it's been here just 45 minutes. I'm planning to paint this for the next four hours. If ask your wife, yeah, you, oh my God, I forgot about that. My wife, she knows about everything. She see everything. She knows everything. My God.
Oh, I, I, I have here a burnt burn umber. What is it? What is it? I'm mixing just here black, camion red, but his or uh, me here is a little bit of yellow. That's what I get this kind of brown, burnt umber, between a burnt umber and a burnt sienna. Maybe this is this should be black. I don't know. I'm mixing black and ultramarine blue. Okay, if this is black, if this is black, that would be a good chance for me to add a highlight just like this. Oh, maybe that blue doesn't work with this one. Yeah. That could add a little bit of color. I mean, more color. Yeah. have this blue here, definitely need to add a little bit of that blue here. Man, harmony. Harmony is just like rhythm in music. When you repeat something, you repeat here, dun, 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 here and there, here and there. Just about to control that, I mean, yes. Right now I think that, that that blue is too much, but let's, let's see. Let's see, it's gonna be red, it's gonna be brown.
This is dark. Just mm. kind of aligned with the, the eyes. Yeah, around here. And the hand is aligned with the chin, a little bit below the chin. Okay. Well, somebody's asking, oh, Denise, how much do you take for a commission? Well, this is uh, $160 plus $20 for the shipping. If somebody want, wants a commission, just let me know. I don't make bigger commissions. I use this size because I'm just trying to, uh, the, uh, I mean, right now for me, it's just too boring just to pay a commission at home, a bigger commission. I prefer to paint here in YouTube and feel the excitement of failed I'm not able, I'm not able to uh, record or make a live stream painting bigger, bigger, painting bigger, I mean, painting bigger paintings. Kind of difficult to see. Let's work on her jacket. Uh, 
uh, I confused the needs at the hundred and or thousand hundred, just hundred, one hundred sixty dollar, no one thousand sixty dollar, one hundred sixty. I think that's a good price. I mean, the paintings are small. This is, this one is 12 by 10 inches. I mean, this one I end up by being like 12 by maybe 14 inches. here maybe yeah I should reduce here here, here. here here is more goes here can you see But you know what? I mean, so many painters have told me lately that I'm charging just too low for the paintings. I should put a little, the price a little bit up high. And, but the paintings are really small. I mean, if you think about these paintings, if you can think about uh, maybe a 40 by 50 inches portrait, that would be like, Maybe more than one thousand dollars. Yes, and thinking in that way, I think this price is okay. Well, I think I'm gonna maybe I'm gonna. I don't know. What do you think? Maybe on that, go a little bit up, a little bit, just a little bit. I don't know. Wow, that's too much hair. <laughs> that, was too, that was too much hair. You see what happened when you're not thinking? while you're painting. I gotta be thinking, I gotta be pay I have to pay attention all the time. Okay, that's better. Another thing about the price, I mean, here for my country, the price is really good.
I mean, not really good, good, like, um, but it's just it's normal price. Okay. okay. Denise, let me, I'm gonna read the comments. Okay. Amazing deal. Okay. Ardesh, you'll be requesting a commission painting soon, okay? I hope I keep the price. <laughs> Art is not a good price until the artist dies. Hope Ransom don't die soon. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to die ever. <laughs> Give us a good glazing medium recipe, please. Uh, no, thank you. <laughs> when I mean succeed, I mean, I guess almost everybody here know how to draw a face, a body, and a hand, but not necessarily a guitar or a chord. Oh, yes. I, I, oh, I should charge more for painting a guitar. <laughs> uh, Trevor, you far too cheap. You should get 1000 for this one. Okay, okay. 1000 Oh, my God. That would be a miss. No, no, that, that, that's... I mean, that, yeah. <laughs> no, that's not fair. 1000 is not fair. I mean, that's too much. Okay, uh, now you see the neck, I should keep this value different from the face. Okay, I'm gonna make this a little bit darker. Every time you're gonna be asking yourself always the same questions about this color is a greater uh, saturation, the color it should be more saturated. It, sh it should be grayer. It should be lighter, darker. It should be warmer. I mean, we have heard, I mean, I have heard the, those advices all my life, all my, all my, my life. And I just started to pay attention to them. I don't, I don't remember when, 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 I started to pay attention to those, uh, let's say, fundamentals. I think I had to improve my painting because that makes the process more uh, conscious and I have more control. Always. Okay. But you know, this is about control, this, the colors, the mixtures is always the same, like here. It should be grayer, it should be warmer, okay? And that you got a nose, obviously, the colors on the face. Here on the nose, obviously, it has to be warmer. On the upper and lower eyelid, it has to be warmer. That's why we say uh, you add a little bit of red. Here, make this color reddish. Okay. Uh, Ardesh is asking me about my song. Uh, yes, I mean, both of them, my, my song and my daughter, they, they just draw a lot. Join his patron. Yes, please join my patron. Okay, I'm going to put my link, the link to my patron. Yes. Because I'm, I'm giving you too much, you need to give me back something back. <laughs> I just kidding, okay? Hello, pa Prava. Denise, in Europe, you are not serious. You sell all painting less than 500 euros. Oh, that's that's good. That's good. Who is she? Stanley, this is a commission. She's a singer, a songwriter, 
she's a daughter, she's a Maggie's Brooks daughter. I mean, I got the commission yesterday. I got the commission yesterday here in, in the live stream. I was making the live stream yesterday about painting this kid, kid with his dog. And then Maggie, she just asked me yesterday if I could paint a commission for her. And that's it, I got, yes. She sent me the image to my mayor. And now I'm painting the commission. Okay, I mean, one thing uh, I'm just doubting here is the light is coming from behind. That means that all this is in shadow, even the face. That means that I have to add some cool colors to the face. But to be honest, mm, being the face that is more, maybe it's not, not going to be like, maybe I shouldn't follow the rules here. I just make the face like she was just getting some strong light from here too. Just to the face, not to the body. I mean, the jacket, I'm going to keep the jacket just shadow and light but on the face i'm gonna add more light which is not gonna it's not gonna follow uh, the any reflected light i'm just break, breaking the rule a little bit just to enhance the face okay i'm gonna put the image here again You wanna read the comments? Hello, Na Nadia, Bipur, then, then Dita. Okay, you already sold pastels about 10 by 10 cent centimeters by almost $100. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay, okay. That make, make me feel that maybe I'm living in the wrong place. <laughs> I should move to Europe.
I mean, that would be kind of impossible for me to move to another country. I mean, it's almost on my fifties. I don't want to get. I don't want to get out from home. Okay, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm starting to see her. That's what I think, at least that's what I think. Let's continue. Stepping back and controlling the size. Because you literally, literally just start moving one eye, the mouth, and then 10 minutes later, your head is too big in relationship with the other part of the painting. Mm, okay. Okay, hello, hello, okay, Joyce, Maggie should be already happy. Oh, Maggie. <laughs> okay, oh, wow, okay, okay, Maggie is having problems with the internet connection. Somebody's asking me about the brush. Oh, I'm using synthetic brushes, that's not just. Okay, I have uh, in the link of the video and the description video. There is a link to some brushes. I mean, though the link is 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 it's not for these specific brushes, but I used those brushes on the link. Okay, it's kind of really similar to these ones. I couldn't find this product in Amazon. Maybe that's because it's so cheap. A set of these ones, there's like six of these brushes in a set, is like two dollars.
Okay, I stop working on the face. I'm gonna move. Let's work on the hand. Now for this I need my computer. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna see you guys for so minutes because I need to use the image in my computer. I'm gonna use the image in my computer. I just block the view of everything. I have the image just in my my whole screen. Okay, okay, okay. Before working on everything else, I just I just have seen some. You know, things to fix.
<clears throat> okay, I'm going to read the comments. Okay. Okay, thank you, thank you. Hello, Chris Elidon. Hmm. Dr. Denise, excuse me, did you, did you use human from John Arthur's bear trunk? Oh, I don't understand that. Okay. It's like a, a, it says uh, there's a sequence with Peruvian army. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, I don't get that. Okay, let's continue. Let me step back. Okay, let's continue with. Need to add a little bit of contrast. Mix in black, a little increase on a little bit of red. I'm gonna add just here a little bit of contrast in here. Let's see. Okay. I mean, I'm counting that this color, this really dark color, is going to get mixed with the color that I already have here. Yeah, remember when we, we paint La Prima? We mix on the palette and we mix on the painting. And since everything is wet, uh, but it depends. I mean, I'm gonna say that. I mean, it's not always like that, like that because sometimes we just want to uh, lay down a brush stroke and just leave it there. In that case, if the painting is so thick, I mean, usually the color that you have previously prepared the palette. That's going to stay the same in the painting. But for me, I just uh, love to do this mix the painting here, blend the paint here. I was looking for this brush yesterday. It's really amazing. You know, I don't use this brush too much. Mostly I use these brushes for, for cleaning my kit, my keyboard. This is dark. I'm not gonna get go with this dark here because as the hair goes to the light, it should be more transparent. I'm gonna keep this darkness just here. Okay. Now I'm gonna add more red and yellow for this part. Obviously, I'm just making this warmer and with red because, I mean, since I have red here, I uh, spread red to the face just a little bit. I think with this is okay in the shadow. I could add more red here too. Yes. But let's see, let's see, I mean. I can add this blue here. Just mix it here to make it darker. But we can see that some of this blue 
in shadow. I kind of like it, but hmm, I'm not that black on top of that. That's okay, I think. Okay, let's work on the guitar. I'll reduce this. Okay, I have this dark. This is not the dark. I already decided. I, I, I turn down, I kill down this. This, I mean, I make this a little bit lighter, and I keep contrast here. I think that would be a great option. Mm. Give a minute, okay? I like, have to give my. Leo, has pedido, no? Tiene mi tarjeta, tú. No se vaya a ir, sal por la ventana. Sorry. Okay. I gotta think about that. I mean, I can just keep this with some kind of mist here, in contrast here, okay? Okay, let's decide that later. Let's continue painting.
Okay, let me think. It looks like there is a highlight. I'm trying to guess, just, I mean, difficult to see, but I'm trying to guess and trying to make things. I mean, this highlight, this light, this warm light is strong light. Okay, this is strong warm light, warm light. It should be hit the hair, it should be hit someone, someone uh, I mean, he should something more. Uh, I don't know, maybe I think just here, I can add the highlight, this warm light. Okay, not so, not so sure about this, but Okay, let's see that the light is coming just and hitting the hand, this warm light. That means that we can have a little bit of a warm light, maybe here. If I have it here, I should add some of that to the fingers. Wow. It's a bigger image. You see that? So difficult to see the fingers. Okay, this is what I wanted with the hand. Now I can see the hand. Not like here. I, here I don't see the hand. Okay. This should be darker.
need to add more shadow here. Okay, let's work on the fingers. I'm going to add a lot of red to the fingers. More red for the knuckles. Try to keep I'm trying to keep some green. You see some green? Oh. But I'm trying to keep the green there. So now I first apply this green and then this pink and now I'm adding more red. much red. Okay. 
Let's blend all the edges here. Let's make insinuate the nails a little bit. I mean, I'm not, I'm not able to see the nails here. Yes. But I just want light to create the illusion that the nails are, are there shining a little bit. Let's add some green here and then some red here. Oh, it was too much. Let's add this more, more yellow. And we may need this yellow chrome. Chrome yellow hue. And more cadmium. And I mix both. Okay, first I gotta, I gotta, I gotta fix something here. I just make hair hand a little bit fat. Okay. Okay, that's better. Okay. Now let's mix this two. A little bit of white. And let's put this here. Let's see if that works. Okay. Then I need to add this yellow here too. Okay, I'm gonna add more. I'm not gonna add the same intensity. I mean, this yellow all over. I gotta choose where I'm gonna just make it this yellow more brighter. Maybe just here a little bit and here a little bit. And just here, I guess you know, be just not that much. Okay. Um, I mean, I'm not saying that you can, I, I could go just like all this bright, but I feel that that's, that would be too bright. Yeah. And now I have the hand in shadow, this highlight. I have, I think this is kind of, okay. This, I'm creating con contrast with this, obviously, because this is, let's say warm colors between warm and kind of going to the greenish violet colors and this blue obviously great contrast and this dark here i mean i can see now her hand because of the background because you know that i'm gonna show you show you the image yes and i, I decided the harmony yes i'm gonna work on the hand here I uh, should maybe move the camera to show you the hand. Okay, let me move. Let me see if I can move the camera a little bit down. Hmm. 
Hmm. It's kind of difficult. Let me see, let me see. Can you see the hand? Yes. Okay, let's work on the hand. This hand here. Oh, I need more, I need more even because I need to paint. Even more. Okay. Now I'm going to do the same. Some green. Obviously, if your paint is dry don't go with this green just like this basically i'm mixing this green with this pinky color that was already here okay and now on top of that i'm gonna add this let's see this color and from here is about to control that I, mean, I gotta put more skin color. Oh my god. This is just... Give me a minute, please. I just want you to see. Oh, I paint the hand. It's okay. Okay, let's continue working with him. One finger here. Here, one here. Okay, four fingers. Can you see the image? It's kind of difficult to see the, the fingers, the first fingers. I'm just trying to, uh, let's say, let's say, trying to just imagine the fingers. I mean, this finger, yeah? OK. 
Okay. Now let's add this right here on the knuckles. It's kind of trying to erase or get rid of the green, but and, and kind of, I mean, but I want the green away, okay? That's what I added at the first place, yes. I mean, in other words, I want both working together here. The green and the pink. What do you think, Maji? Do you like the painting? No, if you don't know, I mean, you're new to my channel. This is a commission from Maggi Brooks from USA. You notice that in my all my videos, my dog, she used to start to bark like at this time, all the time. Now let's add more red here to the knuckles. Here, here. Okay, difficult to see. Okay, I'm gonna just darken the image here on my computer. Because I need to see, I mean, uh, it's not enough by squinting my eyes. I'm not able to see uh, the knuckles. I need to just to do that here on my computer. Not even doing that is kind of really difficult to see. Okay. I mean, um, I darken the image, and what I'm doing is enhancing the contrast. I mean, it's like just squinting my eyes, but obviously, it's obviously much better. Because, I mean, see, but even this image is, is difficult. I mean, even if I, it's, I, I just darken the image here on my screen. And it's difficult to see. Okay, what I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to keep obviously the same uh, colors, but I don't, I don't want the same contrast or intensity like this hand. It's like, this is the focal point. You can read the painting like from here to here and here, something like that. If I add a lot of contrast here and color here, I mean, that's gonna be just another focal point. And that would be okay, yes, I mean, Whatever you, you choose to do, that would be okay. But what I'm just trying to tell you what I'm thinking and what I feel is gonna work for me. Or uh, at least I think it's gonna work. Let's see at the end.
to what's the name of this string strings yes strings one two three four five six six i think yeah one two three four five six six or five okay Okay, I think that's okay. Okay, hello, uh, friend. Okay. Dog is coming, love the paint. Thank you, Maggie. Oh, thank you, Maggie. <laughs> will you, will, you will be wishing you charity to me more because of the hands in the guitar. <laughs> okay. No, no, to be honest, no, 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 I don't agree with that, no. So, Maji, you have two more children and two grandchildren, so I, could keep, I could keep you busy for some time. Yeah, let's do it, let's do it. <laughs> that would be great. I think this has some kind of, it's not a straight, it's kind of curve. I gotta put this straight. I think that's better. Sorry, Maggie, but I cannot be perfect on this. Oh, I didn't realize that it was like they were changing the size. I'm not so good on guitars. I'm going to start from here. And then they were closing. And here they were just getting little by little more open. And little by little they get getting closer and closer. No, I'm just feeling that I should add this color here a little bit. Yes, maybe I have that accent, this accent, this accent. 
I could not maybe just hear a little bit. Just a little bit here. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, I gotta move the camera again. Sorry, I forgot that I was working on the hand. Okay, now the hand is okay here, I think. I don't feel like do doing a lot of details on the hand. It's like uh, it's like the face at this hand is okay. To work a lot here. Uh, you know that when everybody, uh, everything here, this, this, and this pops forward, nothing pops forward. Okay, we gotta just try to be uh, aware of, we try just to drive the attention to one place and maybe to uh, two places or to, to have one or two focal points, uh, no more. I'm gonna use maybe a brush to make this uh, strings. That's that's the word. Yes, string strings. Wow, that's wrong. Anyway, I feel like I should be more precise on this. I don't know, it's like painting somebody, a painter, and not paying attention to his or her brushes. That's the same, yes? She's a musician, she's a songwriter, and the guitar is important, eh? but difficult. That would be okay. Okay, I'm gonna move again. Okay, Let's go back to paint the face. Oh, I gotta finish the guitar. Back here. Okay, I will, I, will, I will throw this just here, 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 and here. Here, here, here. Okay? Yeah. That's correct, I think.
I was holding my breath. Mm -hmm. A little bit darker here because it's too flat. Just one color from, I mean, the guitar, just one color from top to bottom. And obviously, there is not just one color. Bit darker there. I should do the same with this here. Make it appear here a little bit. Make it brighter here. A little bit brighter. there and here the same a little bit here okay 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 go back to work on the face because always face is the most important okay I don't like the guitar it's a mess but uh, okay. <laughs> It's so difficult to work. Wanna see the comments? Hi, Masih, Masih. I always wonder what do you do with the palette? I leave it just like that. Uh, I mean, I have sold like maybe more than 10 of the paintings that I've been doing in my channel. And it's kind of, uh, I just send the, the I just send the paintings with the palette. I mean, I appreciate the palette just there. I hope people appreciate the palette. I mean, not all the people are going to obviously appreciate the palette. I remember I, I have sold one of these with a palette a few years ago. <laughs> when I went to visit this. Uh, I know a guy, yes, uh, he has a lot of money. He's uh, He used to buy me a lot of paintings, a lot of paintings. I don't, I don't know. I mean, he has bought me, he got bought me maybe more than 500 paintings here in my country. He loves art, he collects art. And and uh, I remember I, I he bought me one painting like this with the palette. And when I went to his office, I saw the painting, I didn't see the palette. I said, what happened? <laughs> I just cut this and I throw away the palette. <laughs> oh, I said, oh my God, it was amazing. I mean, you can, I mean, for me, it's just like, a, I repeat all the time, it's like, it's like I can read this, I can see the colors, 
I can I, I kind of understand what what happened here in the process just by watching the palette. Yes, and uh, like I repeat always myself, like I can see here this color how it goes, how I, I did grade down the color here, or uh, how I make it the color brighter, warmer, and all of those variations. Yes, and. Uh, oh, no. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see. The, oh, the, the leg is here. Oh, the leg is. Oh, whoa. This is something funny here. This has some. <laughs> I was changing the, the changing the guitar mark the guitar's model. We're gonna paint her leg is around here, I think. Mm, I need to add more, more shadow here. Okay, let's continue reading the comments. Denise, seems to me you did not paint the side on the left of the... Oh, <laughs> I, I did, yes, I just did it. Uh, okay. Chrisely, a great picture. Oh, okay, that's okay. okay thank you, Monique, Masih. Oh, is your watermark signature? Oh, the palette. Oh, yeah, it looks like. Nano, el grupo de la guitarra se ve un poco del canto. Oh, yes, I just did it. I just did that. Yeah. Yes, exactly, Trevor. It tells a story when you lift the palette. Yeah. Okay, let's continue working. Okay. Okay, I need to blend this. Make it more softer. Make it softer. this
to know that I don't, I don't watch in this image, yeah? Remember that I have one bigger image to my left, another image, and the image in my computer. <clears throat> oh my god, I can, I can move here. I cannot move here in between too many brushes. Just one minute. Do you want me to show you my brushes again? Okay. Here you go. This is the half. Okay, the half here. Yes, <laughs> love this. And adding a lot of yellow here to the, this, uh, 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 no, to these details. Okay, I think I made a mistake here. This is like this. Oh, wow. I mean, it's tilted. I make it this straight, it's tilted. It's more tilted. Can you see? I didn't realize that. Okay, I'm gonna make this. Okay. 
I'm gonna leave it there. Just maybe Maggie doesn't notice. Will notice. Will not notice that. Okay. Okay. Now that I work here and there, now I think I'm gonna spend maybe the next half hour working on the face again. Yes, I just just just, just wanted some space to not think that all the things that I should paint, now I can just work just more relaxed on the face. Let me finish the hair, a little bit of the hair. Okay, I want to keep maybe the highlight here, just here, a little bit just here. I'll be back to the hair later. There. Now, I just want to bring this. Let's work on the face now. Oh, okay. Okay. Hmm. Thank you, Mer Mervat. Crisalida uh, is, is telling me it's possible to see the entire screen. Yeah, I I, mean, I should move my uh, camera, my tripod, like a, a little, a couple uh, uh, centimeters, ba centimeters back, but I don't want to. <laughs> Okay. Well, you mean to see the hair, maybe, eh? Just the hair. There's the hair. I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna move the camera to see up. Okay, that's better. Since I don't wanna work maybe on the hand, I wanna work on the face. Okay, let's work on the face. Let's think, I need to just bring down some colors, I need to enhance some colors. Yes, and. Okay. Uh, first, the nose, a little bit more reddish to the shadow. To 
make the nose a little bit warmer. If, I mean, if you know my channel, you know that what I think when I'm painting the, the face, always thinking about make some colors to uh, come forward and some colors to recede, okay? Always thinking about that, the whole face. Okay, that's one thing. Um, I mean, right now is that, and uh, is thinking about the likeness, yes. And likeness, that would be a nightmare, this size, this side size. Anyway, let's try. The width, I think, is not okay. I'm gonna try to fix that. Mm. This, I need to move here. Okay, I need to make her eyes. I need to make her eyes a little bigger. Okay, not so sure. Not so sure. I have to make this a little bit darker. I need to blend here. Let's see, here's different. Red.
I'm just paying attention to values. This should be a little bit darker. Okay. Even here, a little bit darker. No, I mean, it's a mistake there. I gotta move it. Okay, that's better. Okay, now I gotta go and make her eyes darker. We see the comments. Uh, okay. Why is it, uh, okay. Let's continue. Let's continue. Mm. Okay, let's go a little bit darker again with this eyebrow. Right now, I'm just thinking about the likeness, and in order to get the likeness, we need to get the values right. That's why I'm making it here a little bit darker. And then maybe I'm gonna go a little bit lighter. Okay. Difficult, difficult to get to get it right.
her upper lip. I think it should be darker and thicker. I think that's okay, but I need to blend it. I just cannot leave it just like there, like, like that. Okay, I'm moving the mouth. Well, hmm, little by little. I got to go back and forth because that's the only way. Step back, I see. I correct something. Sometimes I gotta just put it, put it back to where it was. And then again, and again, and again. Always being careful here, I mean, this part of the mouth, the corner of the mouth, you can change the expression so fast, change the face expression so fast. You gotta be careful with that. We can make her smile a little bit just by working here, the corners. We can make it, make it, make her sad. Sorry, sorry, I just... Uh, I just got lost here thinking about this.
Okay, let's read the comments just to get distracted a little bit. Oh, Stanley, oh, Stanley, you don't know where, where I am from? That's the question. I'm from Lima, Peru. Yes, I usually paint, Rick, I usually paint, I make live streams Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday around this time. I'm just scrolling up to see if I have lost some question. Or some critique. Let's continue working on the face. You know, face is always the most important part when you when we are painting a commission.
But see, there's a mistake in the width of the face here. Yeah? And here. Up. Well, not that much, but I want to blend it a little bit now. Okay. Mm, I think I need to add some dark here. Okay, I'm gonna check out the hand. Okay, so then. Mm. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna check out this here.
Stepping back and checking out everything again. Let's go work on the hair a little bit. You don't see this working here on the hand. Making the hand more reddish. Okay. 
Okay. Now I gotta think um, again everything. I gotta check out everything again. Kind of I don't like uh, this here. I mean, there's color here, but there's no color here. It's just like I, it should be the same. It should continue. And at the same time, of course, I'm thinking maybe making this a little bit darker. But let's see. Okay, that's better, I think. Maybe some accents. Here. Just there. Okay. Just there a little bit. I'm stepping back trying to see if I just can enhance the color here and there. Maybe he's well, I shouldn't use this brush, it has too much blue. This is one. color here too. trying to say okay, okay, okay. Mm. 
I feel that, uh, I mean, I love this blue, but I don't see this blue because this blue is just kind, kind of the same strength. I should kill this blue a little bit. I'm not, not fully sure about this, but let's do it and let's see what happens. So, I, mean, I think I too bright now. <laughs> That's okay. It should add mm, more, mm, more color here or more color here. I don't know. I mean, sometimes when we start thinking about color, we kind of start, stop. It's just like when I start just adding more details to the face and make, making the face older. Let's see. Trying to just to make these comfort pops forward just by adding more blue to the background and create something that let's say the, the, the this blue communicates from here to here to here. Because I was feeling like it was, I mean, it was the same obviously background, but at the same time it was kind of different because it was one color here and one color. A different color here. Definitely here's, here it works perfect because it creates more contrast here with the orange. And now here I still feel like I, I, I should knock down this. But not so sure anymore. I mean, I mm, don't think that's important. <laughs> like. Too important, but but I don't know. Hmm. Difficult to take all decisions. I mean, I tried. I tried to think about everything about harmony. Obviously, I mean, we always choose. I mean, it's so simple with harmony, like blue and red and orange works perfectly. Yes, I try to keep the face kind of in shadow at the same time light up because if you see, I mean, her face should be darker if we think that the light is coming from back. This is everything in shadow, okay? And that means that the the face has too much light, has, has too light, it's too, I should uh, dark completely the face. Even I feel the hand is even, it's a little bit darker than the face. Yes, but I, I, I mean, I'm repeating myself again and thinking about this, but I choose to do, I choose to do that. I have chosen to do that because, I mean, obviously the face is a focal point. If the face is in shadow, I mean, maybe uh, it's going to be just, it's going to be maybe 
the the color that in shadow is kind of used to used to be kind of violet purple and I don't know how to explain this, but I mean, I, I try to get a balance, okay, between a face in shadow, at the same time, it has a little bit of color, and a, a, so a little bit of light, or they say a reflected light a little bit. Yes, but I mean, I'm aware that for this kind of reflected light on the face, there should be a reflected light here that should make this brighter, more reddish. But at the same time, I wanted this to be kind of reddish, orangey, but I didn't want it to be too bright. I just was thinking about the accent to be bright. Yes. Okay. I'm stepping back, I think it works. The only thing that this kind of butter, uh, it's kind of, uh, I don't feel like very comfortable with is the the guitar? I don't know why the guitar. I feel the guitar is should be another color. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why. It's just a, it's a feeling. Yeah, when you see something, I mean, and you feel like it's too much of this color here. It's like too much. That you you should change something here. It could be the guitar. It could be more what? I don't know. I don't even know. Nice. If I choose from here, maybe it should be like this color here. In this way, like kind of split all this mass of brown, brownish, reddish color because it's huge. Okay. Hmm. The only thing that separates these two is just this line. Obviously, and the hand, yeah? Let's see. But I feel that's not enough. I feel that I should do something more. I mean, there's no way to, to know sometimes what to do. We need to rest, we need to leave, take a rest from the painting and come back to the painting and analyze the painting, thinking about composition, obviously, because when you're dealing with color, we are dealing with composition and how, how to do, how to create the perfect balance. That's what we're trying to do, perfect balance between those masses of color, okay? You see up, you see down. And obviously, uh, every time that we get we get lost in composition, we have to go back to the fundamentals, yeah. always. I mean, uh, one thing about composition, let's say, uh, we shouldn't have um, we should have something big, something a little or, or, or a little bit smaller, and something small. We cannot have two or three masses of the same same size or same color, okay? Because it's kind of, they compete between them. And that doesn't create harmony, okay? One thing, uh, another thing that would be about brighter colors. There should be just one or two, even three accents that would be bright, bright or saturated colors, like this case, like this. It could be really saturated, but it's just maybe just even just 2% of the painting. Because this blue is not that saturated, it's not pure blue, I yeah, added yeah, white. And this yellow here, obviously, if it's not pure yellow, okay? It's kind of, you take out, away this color, you wanna see that this kind of a muddy color, a low greenish, yes. And, but if I start adding more yellow there, I just gonna, Maybe I'm feeling they can lose the control of that color. It could be too bright, 
that it could drive too much the attention there. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. One way, another way I'm thinking is maybe I, I should add more darkness here to the guitar. In this way, kind of compensate all the mass here with this. That this is trying to hold everything of this to like to lay down to the side. Okay, that would be that could be some uh, some solution. Okay. I'm just thinking out loud all the all the possibilities about how to. I mean, I think the paint. I like the painting. I think it's okay. But if I can make it better, I should try to make it better. Yeah. And the only way for me is just to go back to the basis, go back to the rules, go back to the fundamentals, and think about that all the time. Okay. Okay, that's the part, obviously, that we have to think about color, composition, all of that. Uh, is because it's, it's not it's not just put color to a to an image that doesn't have color. It's just it's have we have to deal with uh, the distribution of that color. Okay. And if uh, and we have to think that about the light that is hidden here, the light. The light has to create that that air here. The illusion of this is something three-dimensional. Okay. And another thing, another aspect, and the most important, obviously, is the likeness. I mean, there is kind of there is not too much to do with the likeness. Likeness is just putting together proportion, values, color in the face, and always is gonna be like. I don't know how to say, but I mean, that's going to be always difficult. There is not a formula to get the likeness right, like all the time. Okay. I mean, there are some ways to try to improve on the likeness, of course, but there's no, there's no, there is not a formula. But anyway, if you want to learn about the likeness, go to my Patreon account. <laughs> okay, I was planning this to be four hours. I think I think that's enough. I mean, I pretty sure I, I, I gotta go back to this painting and add some glazes and with that try to make it better. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Maggie? Knock down the middle blue with a touch of white, maybe. Okay, could be a solution. 
round forest. <laughs> right, so make the guitar in the color you think works. Oh, magic. Okay. Guitar in black, dark gray would be fine. Oh, wow. Guitar in black, dark gray. Okay, that would, uh, yeah, that could be a solution. Mm, okay. Forest him, follow your instinct as a painter. Okay. okay. That, 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 that's what I'm trying to avoid. I mean, I'm trying to follow rules, follow everything that I have learned about color theory, about composition, all the things that I can apply. I mean, I don't want to rely on my intuition, okay? Because, I don't know, I just, I feel like uh, I got to combine both, okay? One thing, it's like the other day, I heard a painter say saying something like, okay, I don't think about, he was making a, a demo and he was saying, I don't think about uh, what I do. Usually I'm, I'm really so intuitive about when, when I paint. And then somebody asked him, have you studied in the School of Art? And he, yes, yeah, I have studied for six years. I mean, if you have studied for six years, I mean, you don't have like that kind of intuition because in the School of Art, we were, we learn by repetition. And when you repeat something a lot, what it creates is a muscle memory about that. Maybe you think you're being intuitive, but you're applying what you have learned by repetition. What is already there in your head, in your mind, in your brain, for so many years of doing the same in the same. And one thing is that you don't know, maybe you're not aware of that, but definitely it's there. And I cannot say I cannot I cannot say the same. I mean I cannot say that I'm working by intuition or I'm trying to be intuitive. Seems I have repeated this analysis about color theory, composition, all of that 1,000 times, and it's always different, and it's always a challenge, okay? Hmm. Okay, I just so tempted to change the guitar. Let's change the, the color. If it's no work, I mean, I gotta put it back again. <laughs> Okay, no, no. I remember, I mean, Maggi told me that's a wooden guitar. Okay, okay, I, I can I cannot change this because I mean, this is about her guitar. I mean. She could she could have a red red guitar and she could use a red dress. And that doesn't mean that you if you paint her, you're gonna change that because you say, oh too much red. No, no, that's her guitar. We gotta respect that. I mean it's not it's not about just always make a painting like okay, it is I mean if your model has blue shoes and a blue pen and a blue t-shirt and he wants you to paint with all the blue what you gonna do you're gonna take okay sir no you gotta change your shoes <laughs> why oh because of the composition of me my painting I forget about that. Well, was I was about about to just I mean the king you know what came to my mind? I mean my, my, my daughter she has a guitar and I, I imagine just painting her with her guitar it's kind of like this and changing the color and she, she was like oh, what what happened? I mean my guitar is this color, why do you change that the, the color? I don't like the guitar. <laughs> Okay, okay. I'm gonna let, I'm gonna just stay there. Maggi, I'm gonna make some retouches, some glazes. Okay, to fix some little parts of the painting, and and uh, as soon as I finish, I will send you an image. Well, and 
think that's it, eh? You know, I mean, but mostly is this, this is gonna be like this is. I mean, the changes that they're gonna do. I saw saddles. I used to add some glazes to the face. Just some retouches, maybe put some more order on the hair, a little bit. And you see, the hair is kind of just. Mm. And what do you think, Maji? Tell me, tell me something before I finish. Something that you feel that I, I should change. I should just fix. Let me see if I can, uh, let's, let, let me move. I'm gonna take out the photograph from here. I'm gonna try to move my camera. I don't know how to do it. I mean, let me see if I can just. Difficult to, I mean, I want to see the whole the whole painting. Can you see this later? Okay, Maji. Okay, remember to sign it. You will famous one day. Okay, thank you so much, Maji. May I ask you, do we see some of the side of the guitar? Oh, I think I don't think so. <laughs> no. Maybe. No, no, no. no. It doesn't look like we see any in the guitar. No. Okay, okay, I'm gonna give it there. Thank you, Maji, for the commission. I'm gonna make some retouches. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna let it dry for uh, three days. And then make some retouches. Mo mostly the retouches are gonna be about the, about the face because I need to get, I mean, I cannot get close to the painting because I have my camera here. Okay, my camera is blocking myself to get close to the painting because I have my tripod to have. And I gotta get closer to work on details on the face. To make the iris, to make a little, to make, to work on the pupil. Yes, that's the more important thing. I mean, at the end, I'm speaking about the colors here and there. But nothing of this is important if this is not okay. Okay, in a portrait, I mean, you're gonna spend maybe 10 months, a year working here, but if the face is not okay, it doesn't matter. That's how cruel is painting a portrait. <laughs> okay, that's why, I mean, uh, mostly I'm gonna, I'm gonna just retouch 
the face, add some glazes, add some details. Try to get the likeness a little bit better. And then maybe here on that, maybe some, I don't know, I'm gonna see if I change this or not. Okay, thank you so much to all of you for being here with me during the process. My dog is calling me, it's time, time to eat. <laughs> There's a kind of reflection. Okay, bye, take care. Okay, Maggie, buenas noches. Bye-bye, take care.